Hi, my name is Pete Preston and welcome to day 19 of our 30 days of demos video series on the new form builder in Jira Service Management Cloud. Today, we're talking about third-party data or API connections that you can use to bring data into your form fields. Before we look at data connections in the form builder itself, we actually have to go back to Jira Service Management and the settings. So we'll click on the gear icon in the top right and then issues. And once we're on this screen, we'll scroll up on the left-hand menu until we see the form section and the data connections. Now you'll notice that we have one data connection here, the sample forms data connection that I just created. And this is what that data connection builder screen and flow looks like. Connect, test, configure, and confirm with authentication and cache options that you have. And there are different options along this workflow here that are pretty self-explanatory and that we won't go into right now. But once you've created this data connection, one that you can see on this screen here, and you've now gone to your form builder, you can select from these choice fields. So right now we're selecting item, let's just say, and we've highlighted that field in the form builder itself. And on the right hand side, the settings menu, you'll see data connection. And right now it's set to do not link. But if we want to connect it to the sample forms data connection, data connection, <laughs> we can do that right there. And once we click save changes, this now will pull from items in that API, which you can see here is just an IP address. But that's how you, you connect your data. Go back to Jira Service Management, go to Settings, Issues, Data Connections, create the connection that you need, and then you can start using those in your forms. If you'd like to get notified of all the videos coming out in this series, please click that bell icon and subscribe to the channel.